Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Simply Grown. It is currently four something in the morning. We have to be out the door at 5.30 a.m. It is officially C-section time. Well, you know, day for us to get ready. Our C-section's at eight. I'm so excited. I've already showered and did something with my hair, but it's gonna be put up. I was debating on whether to do makeup or not, but I don't think that makeup would be a good idea because I'm gonna cry. And then I'll be looking crazy because my everything will be running down my face. Um, but yeah, so waiting for Stephanie to get up at 4.30. She has her alarm set, so I'll check back in in a little bit. Good. <laughs> I'm hungry, but it looks like she's getting my IV ready. No way, because she's <laughs> okay. I'm obviously in there, so I don't want to come out and not be sleepy again, so just bear with me, okay? Tell them about your obby. So, she tried to go with an arm, and it didn't work, so she did the hand, and it was like a 3 out of 10, not that bad. And now we're late. Are you nervous? No. I'm just excited. Just excited. That's some really, all I have a really good one. Uh, the platter thing that with tapes up, if you decide to use that, just kind of, it just helps give the next repair of hands. That's really not hands. It pulls it back. Once he makes the initial incision, he'll let you in. And then from there, baby comes. Um, well, they, how do they work after she's born? Do they bring her to me or does she immediately go to? She will, uh, you'll take her drop. You know, they'll dry her off, they'll show you to her, and everything, and hold her for just a minute to pick it. If she's doing fine, then they'll have you walk her to the nursery with the nurse practitioner. Mm -hmm. And once, you know, you get pictures of it being weighed and measured, all that good stuff. Because mama don't get to see that. Once we bring you back in here, they'll bring her back in here for you, and you can do your IR bonding. You know, your skin to skin at that point. You need more than skin to yeah. skin? Okay, yeah. You'll that's busy. when I try to breastfeed her. Right. Okay. When we go back, we'll have you sit in a little chair while we're getting her ready and they're getting her spine on in because they won't let you sit in for that. Uh, you'll have a gown on, shoe covers on, a hat on, that kind of good stuff. And then once you take her to the nursery, they won't let you back in there. You'll come back in here and sit, okay? okay. So, any other questions? No. Nope. Nope. So what we'll do, I'll just go over here. You want me to swing over to the head? Or? What we'll do is swing you over to, feet over to this side, we'll back that out, we'll just go straight to the ground. All right, push your back out towards that, my thumb. Hold these. Blood pressure right now. Yeah. It'll be that much. Yeah. I think he's putting that going here, putting her. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sometimes this is a good option. 
Now you gonna be okay? You know, I'm pass out on us. Okay. Oh, thank you. We've had them do that before. You just relax. I think the numbing's the worst part. Yeah, I mean, it burns. It's not anything like the IV. The IV's the worst thing. That's what everybody tells me, all the patients. The IV is nothing. Oh, yeah? Well, that's good. I usually hurts everybody. Alright, we'll prep you spot right there with my fingernail. Alright, with these things. Oh my goodness, yeah, it is with these things. Sorry. Oh, that burns. But you wouldn't want him doing this without you being numb. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Make a little shocker. <laughs> yeah. Oh wow. Sorry. Ouch. It might get uncomfortable. Hold still. Alright, needle's coming out. Needles out. You can relax. Hard parts over with. I'm telling you, that would have been, this was a lot easier than that spine would have been. Okay, have to go over this. <laughs> okay. Pull this back a little bit. Jeez. You doing okay? Yeah. Are you still having like a, you know, uh, that funny bone feeling? It's called a paresthesia. You have any, any of that going down your legs? No. All right, we're gonna do a little test dose. And we'll take so this how, how, how bad did that hurt? <laughs> the epidural process was about an eight or nine. It was, it was not pleasant at all. Okay, so she is back there now and I'm so nervous. Just waiting about 10, 15 minutes before I can go in. <sighs> I'm just going to reach on through. So they're going to mount something really hard. You're going to get a lot of pressure. 
got your camera ready. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Can you take a picture? Uh, y'all together? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You just took me out of here. Okay. Thank you.
How do you feel? A lot better. Still. Protection was uh, kind of scary when it got started because it feels like somebody's sitting on your chest. Thank you. You're welcome, honey. But did you feel any pain besides that one time you felt it in your bottom area? Mm -mm. One time. So did you? So did you like the C-section? All right. I know it's not something to like, but do you think you would have liked that better then? I feel like it worked best for me. I did almost freak out a couple times, especially when you weren't there. Did I make it better or worse? Not better. I almost freaked out. Because you know how hard it was to sit in that hallway and listen to them count utensils or count what they needed for the surgery. And I'm just sitting out there like a lost puppy waiting to go in and check on you. I was so scared for you. I was like, I was so ready for you to come back in there. I was so ready. <laughs> Is it bright in here? Your mama, she loves natural light. I mean, loves it. Yeah, we're never gonna not have natural light. You're so little. Oh, she put a little white hat on her to match. So it is now 4.45 exactly. And um, she's doing good. Uh, Chelsea's having some nausea, um, having some itching from the anesthesia. Um, no pain right now. They've been pretty good about managing her pain, but she has had some nausea. That's making her uncomfortable and she needs to take a nap. She's very tired. But Miss Mam is doing very well. She's been opening her eyes and talking and smacking her lips. And now she's gonna smile for you guys. Maybe. Yeah, you gonna give her a little grin? Today, her nanny should be coming to see her again. Her grandma should be coming to see her. Her godparents and her god sisters are coming to see her today. Her papa may stop by again. Because our COVID cases are so high right now, we are having them come to the window and look at her through the window. She really is in perfect. Every single way. She is the most beautiful baby I think I've ever laid my eyes on. My eyes, my eyes. <laughs> I'm tired, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, definitely. We did, well, I didn't want to send her to the nursery. I was just asking for maybe a couple hours. <laughs> she just re recharged my battery. Got her, she says no. She loves spending time with her mom. She does not like that passy. And it's so cute. She would rather have the little hospital one. Like, what is this? 
So I look so rough, but um, I got up for the first time for, from my C-section and I've been free bleeding since they brought us into the room yesterday and it was miserable. I also um, was very itchy from the epidural, still am. I could probably dig some holes in the skin. We are working on getting discharged. She has been completely cleared and I'm just waiting for my doctor to get out of surgery to clear me. I look a hot mess. <laughs> oh, but we have all of our stuff packed and Stephanie has loaded the car. So we are just waiting and she is sleeping in her favorite spot ever. It's either on mama or mommy.